The computer science teacher has asked the students of class 8A to create a table named teacher details with the given fields and then do the following. Enter 10 records. Create a form for data entry and format it as per their choice along with a logo. Create a query to display teacher ID, teacher name, department and date of joining in descending order. Create a report for the query created in the previous step. The report is to be grouped by department. First, we open Access 2013 and create a new database. The new database will open with one table, that is, Table 1 in Data Sheet View. Now, click the View drop-down menu arrow and select Design View. Access will prompt you to save the table. Enter the table name as Teacher Details and click OK. This will open the table in Design View. Type in the field names, select the required data types and enter the descriptions. Select the Teacher ID field and click the Primary Key button in the Tools group on the Design tab to make it the Primary Key field. Next, click the drop-down menu arrow of the View button in the Views group on the Design tab and switch back to the Data Sheet view. Now, enter 10 records by using the Tab key to move from one column to the next. Before we move ahead, answer this question. Click on the correct option. You can edit a form using which of the following views. Moving on, click on Form in the Forms group on the Create tab to create a form. The form will appear on the screen in Layout view. Next, click the Design tab and then click on Logo in the Header Footer group. The Insert Picture dialog box appears. Select a suitable logo and click on OK. Now click on Title in the header footer group and type a new title. In the header footer group, click on Date and Time, select a suitable format and click OK. Next, click Themes in the Theme group and select a theme of your choice. Then click on Fonts in the Themes group and select a font you prefer. Now select the Format tab. Then click the down arrow of Shape Fill in the Control Formatting group. Select a desired color from the color palette that appears. Then click the Save option on the Quick Access toolbar and in the Save As dialog box that appears, type FRM Teacher Details and click OK. Now to create a query, click Query Design in the Queries group on the Create tab. The Show Table dialog box appears. Select the Teacher Details table. Click on Add and then click on Close. Then drag the Teacher ID, Teacher Name, Department and Date of Joining fields from the table to the Query Design grid. Now select the Ascending option in the Sort menu of the Date of Joining field. Then click on Run in the Results group of the Design tab to run the query. Finally, save the query as QRY Teacher Details. Now select the Query QRY Teacher Details in the Navigation pane. Click on Report in the Reports group on the Create tab. The report will appear on the screen. Then save the report as RPT Teacher Details. If you wish to print the report, click File and select Print in the menu that opens. Select Print Preview in the center pane if you want to see how the report will look on paper or click Print. In the print dialog box that appears, select the required options and click OK. Finally, the task is completed.